Hey guys, so uh, I'm just making a quick video to show you how you can send an invoice with PayPal in 2022. Um, so sending a PayPal, uh, an invo invoice with PayPal is free, quick, it's very easy, uh, and it has all the options that you may need. Um, so basically, an invoice, you, you, you guys know what it is. You know, you need to, uh, somebody needs to pay you for something. They would like an invoice, probably for their own tax purposes. You send them an invoice. Now, how to do it with PayPal? It's very simple. You go and you log into your PayPal account. I'm going to show you now live in a minute. You, you log into your PayPal account. At the top of the page, you click send. Then you click where it sends send an invoice. You fill in the email of the person to who you want to send the invoice. You add an item name and the price for the item, and you can add multiple items. I'll show you in a minute. You click send, and that's it. After you send the, well, let's do it now. So here we are in PayPal. Now, see where it says up here, send. You click send. Now see where it says send an invoice. You click send an invoice. Okay, here we are. So, you most of the things on the invoice page can be left blank. Uh, you do need to put in the email address of the person to who you're sending the invoice. You need to put an item, so email here, uh, item name, you know, uh, you know, 5,500 words article or logo creation or WordPress coding work, whatever it may be item name here and the price so 50 bucks now see for me it's in euros because it's my default but you can come up here and change and put any of these currencies let's put usd all right we're at 50 usd so we put in the email we put in the item name we put in the price and that's it basically we're good to go you can go ahead and click the send button here now up here now of course you can also like see subto subtotal other discounts so you can add a discount you can add shipping like charge separately for shipping or whatever you can add a terms and conditions reference number <coughs> allow tip payment options allow partial partial payment like you can add multiple multiple items or services so and that's it and after you click send uh the invoice is sent and you're going to receive an email from PayPal that looks something like this invoice sent we sent your invoice to blah 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 for $22 or whatever now after you send the invoice you can edit it edit it at any time uh, before your client pays it so you I'm not going to show you now I don't have any invoices but you just go back to your PayPal account where we were before and you locate the invoice that you sent and you click you know to edit it you go in, you can change the price, you can do, you know, whatever you whatever you want. You just can't change the recipient, like the email to who you send the invoice. But you can change the price, the discount, and all the other stuff. Okay, now once your client pays the invoice, uh, you'll receive an email like this from PayPal. you receive the blah, 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 payment for your invoice. Thanks for using PayPal, etc. Some customer information, the transaction ID, uh, the fee taken stolen by paypal etc <clears throat> so in conclusion uh, the 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 invoicing process on paypal it's free it's fast it's quick it's easy and it works well and it's been working like this for years now you know i have some hate for paypal they, they kind of suck but the invoicing process is is pretty straightforward and i i think they they do it better than anybody else you know, you don't have to go and find a template of their invoicing in an, like an Excel or a Word file and then edit that. And no, you send it directly uh, uh, through PayPal. So that's pretty cool. Um, and in fact, one interesting little thing that may or may not have happened once upon a time, somebody wanted to pay me for something on, on TransferWise and they wanted an invoice. And I just don't work with invoices. People pay me and... I deliver what I deliver and then that's it there's no invoicing there's no nothing so but once once occasionally somebody's gonna ask me for an invoice and in this case the, this customer asked me for an invoice paid me on transfer wise and I sent him I don't know 100 bucks 
and then I sent him an invoice with PayPal for 100 bucks. Now, as I assume he said it was fine. I assume he just used the invoice that I sent him on PayPal to like, you know, for tax purposes for that expense. But in fact, he had paid me on transfer wise. I don't know how he, you know, I don't know, <clears throat> but, but it worked, right? Somebody needed an invoice and you know, we did that and it worked. So that's another interesting little thing you can, you know, have in your arsenal. Uh, okay, guys, basically that's it. Uh, that's how you send an invoice with PayPal. If you have any questions, uh, comments, if you'd like to say something, you can leave a comment below this video or you can click in the link of in the description of this video. There's a link that's going to bring you here to my website. You can check out the article, look at these screenshots a bit more closely if you want. Uh, leave a comment, check out my other articles. And yeah, that's it, guys. Uh, please like the video, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video.